35 miles per hour will be our high wind gust today. No high wind warning, wind advisory. So we are calmer than yesterday, but still a breezy day overall. And uh, we will continue to see these winds even into the first half of your Monday. It's going to take truly some time throughout the day tomorrow for these winds to relax. So here's a look at your Sunday. Sunshine all day long. 42 degrees at noon, 45 before the day is done, and that sun sets at 508. And then we stay dry and quiet overnight, mostly clear. Temperatures dipping back into the lower and mid-30s. And we'll hold on to that sunshine and dry conditions for Monday and Tuesday. Then come Wednesday, where we pick up future track now, this is where we get our next rain chance. Now, this is the European model. It paints with a wide brush, so keep that into perspective. It's a stray shower chance on Wednesday, more likely rainfall in a scattered fashion possible on Thursday as the system moves through, and then we will have our temperatures drop on Thursday as well. We will pinpoint finer details as we get closer to the middle of the week, but this system, it's really moisture starved, so there's not a whole lot there. Between Wednesday and Thursday, we'll gain about a, a quarter to an inch of a rainfall with our higher rainfall totals uh, looking like to be around the I-94 corridor at the moment. Again, touch back later in the week for uh, any updates on that as we get closer to those rain chances. But in the meantime, nothing but sunshine and only increasing our warmth. 47 degrees tomorrow, 50 on Tuesday. And this is only the beginning of our warmth. Look at Wednesday and Thursday, 59 and 60 degrees as we do usher in some of that rain. And then even on Friday, we still stay above average. This time of year, we should be 37 degrees for our daytime highs. So we'll stay above that on Friday. Then rain snow mix chances on Saturday, really light stuff expected, 34 degrees for your high there. But even looking past Saturday, we've said this for several days. The Climate Prediction Center is putting us in above average temperatures, and now this takes us right to our Christmas holiday. So our chances of snow and a white snowy Christmas are continuing to dwindle. With a temperature profile like this, very hard to have snow and have it stick around.